Yeah, Lutheran women is an interesting uh, topic. Uh, first of all, because of his marriage to Katharina von Bora, that's a fascinating history. And you could make a movie out of that, the way they got together, and that she proposed to him instead of the other way around. And he got stuck with her. He got rid of the other ten nuns, but he couldn't find the right guy for for uh, for her. And then the way he writes, he respects her, and and you know she admonishes him. Um, upgrade of women, also when it concerns education, uh, that this reformation of education means it's not more. It's not anymore that theology is the real thing, and the rest is all a step down. Um, education also for women. Uh, the, the upgrade of marriage, which is uh, very important for women also. Uh, on the other hand, he can say things about women that, you know, y you can laugh about it, but in, in fact it is, it is sad, you know, about women having broad hips. And w that means that the creator made them that way so they could sit down at the homes, uh, things like that. We uh, at our house, in our family, we, we've read the table talks, uh, 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 and, um, and the, the kids like that. But then one moment, Luther says, uh, why are uh, girls sooner mature than boys? That's his question. And he says, it's easy because weeds grow faster than roses. Uh, well, I got four daughters. They had it with Luther ever since then. Um, it, you can laugh about it, but it also gives a certain uh, view of women that I think we've learned that is it's unbiblical to do it like that. So it's it's kind of um, how should I say controversial the way he speaks about women upgrades and downgrades.